All right, let's head on down. Did I? <laughs> we're just going to just ignore whatever just happened. I don't know what just happened. That was a lot of things happening. <laughs> and this would be Penny's thing. Biometric identification and project and pro project. <sighs> Identities confirmed. Access granted to lower level. Ooh, it opened for us automatically. Not quite. Looks to me like someone's controlling this thing remotely. Once you step through, you'll be above. Why above? We want to be at. Don't oh, we? You have brought Mar You have brought Maridon with you. I don't know if I like this. Thank you for bringing it with you on your many adventures. If you if you utilize Maridon's gl gliding capabilities, you should be able to descend into the depths to reach area zero. What? What? <laughs> Thank you, Penny. Isn't there like an elevator or something? And wait, did you say Maridon could fly? Technically, he glides. When you reach the bottom, I will get in touch once again. I hope your trip is uneventful. Railroading people into stuff like <laughs> into stuff just like always. Can't wait to see what Pokemon live down in Area Zero. Let's go! That girl, is she, like, incapable of fear of, or what? <laughs> I guess we better go to... How are they getting down? Ready for the worst? Good, that's all we needed to hear. Get out that Pokemon of yours and we'll be off. I guess we're all going to ride Maridon. What's the matter with it? Hmm. Scared of heights? That's what I'd say. Well, no wonder. But there's no need to be scared if we go together. How does that logic work? Get on! Um... What? <laughs> also, what? I like how I'm the last one to get on and I'm only getting on after they take off without me. Also, again, like, ooh, just I just saw me disappear, and now I'm I'm back here again. I think I might have died once or died twice there. It's okay. I don't think he likes it either. Ah, it chose to go back into its ball. It's probably just hungry or something. Yeah, that's it. Wait a second. Where's the stu student council girl? I bet she's off exploring. What? She's gone? You don't think she... Everybody, you have to see this. Your area zero is amazing. Come on already. I guess your ability would be old temple. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in progress. Before humans in any conditions, that are vital signs are all normal range. 
Here's you're able to make the descent without being harmed. Is he even person? Is he alive? <laughs> yeah, sure. Smooth sailing. Who could have possibly complained about a landing like that? That is good. I had concerns you might fail, given the crudeness of the only available access method. Hmm. I think your dad's sarcasm detector <laughs> needs fixing. Aw, uh, were you worried about us? That's so sweet. You should now make your way to me at the Zero Lab in the deepest part of Area Zero. However, the entrance to the lab is barred by four locks. Of course it is. Installed on the exterior, which I cannot unlock. Four locks. On your way to me, you must visit four research stations that are constructed inside the crater. They look like that. Each station, you'll be able to disable one of the locks. Do so as you make your way down. I hope you succeed. Are we at one? Also, what is the sparkly? There are sparkly everywhere. Let's disable the four locks and get into that lab! Sounds kind of video gamey when you say it out loud, huh? Speaking of... Come on, time to find our way to the deepest part of Area Zero! That sparkles behind me. And in, in front of me, that's a Venomoth. And Metacham. And are they all going to follow me? <gasps> We're a party. I'm guessing this is not a lab. Because that would be too easy. Why is it sparkly, though? That's what I'm wondering. Ha ha. No, really. I, I, I'm asking a legit question. Why is it sparkly? I... I guess I shouldn't worry about these Pokemon, though. Because... Although that right shoe is tempting. Alright, so this is. Oh, but I see a lab from here. Actually, can we see the labs? I see the one. I see whatever that is, that rock. Okay, that's a lab. Actually, look. Uh, it looks like a lab's down there, unless that's the. Um, Okay, lock. That's what I'm gonna say. I'm gonna call these locks stations. That could be a that could be a station or a lock down there, um, or lab. That's what I meant to say. I don't see unless it's these blue ones out in the that's right above my head. Unless those two over there are labs, station locks, rainbow. I don't know. We'll find out. Oh, it's a Corviknight. Oh, it's a... So this is incri... This... So this... No, oh, feels different from seeing it on a text box. Sorry, I cannot read because I am dumb. It's a giraffe rage. Not only we never be able to get in here. Oh, huh? Wait, where'd Maridon do? As soon as he got stooped by something, it's hiding in his ball. Is uh, it real? It's not good. Can we get back up to the surface without it? Uh, it should be all right. Last time I was here, I caught a flying taxi out of the crater. They always come through. Why didn't you just call the press professor if he's down here? Don't get along. None of your business, Pip Squeak. Jeez, no. No need to bite my head off. You're getting... Hey, come on, you two. This is an adventure. Have a good time. Um, I see. I'm going to... I'm going to slow the text down because it might be going moving too... F it's moving too fast for me because I, I can't... I can't... I can't... <laughs> I can't read that quickly. I can't read and speak that quickly. 
Hey, it's a Bravarver. Yeah, this thing. You. Look, you're not. Is that ever. Is that what they normally look like? No, that looks normal. I don't. I don't. I just, it just looked weird. It just, I don't know. I'm not, I'm not used to that Pokemon enough to know. And I knew, I know it has a, another, a, uh, Hisuian form. That's obviously not it. Like, I know the Pokemon exists, I just... I'm not familiar with it enough. Alright. Is that a sparkle on the ground? No. Sparkles everywhere. That is very shiny. Wait, that looked like that X. Okay. Uh, or, or any, if I see a sparkle on the ground, I'm going to ignore it because I'm just going to confuse it. Is there going to be a lab over here? Ooh, no, but there's a TM. <gasps> TM. Hey, sparkle. An actual sparkle. Bright powder. Citrus berry. It's gold duck move. Gold duck move. Gold duck move. We have Hydro Pump. Citrus, Citrus. I'm guessing these are no, going to be nothing but oh, Salak. Citrus. Okay, they're mostly going to be Citrus Berries. I haven't tried sending up Maridon, but I don't think he's going to come out of the ball. Citrus, citrus. I know I'm missing out on a sparkle, but yeah, it's mostly citrus. Oh, we got a TM out of that. And a Corviknight. That's a little... Is this in lab? I don't think I want to jump down. <laughs> if I follow this, will, I, it be, will everything be fine? We're getting closer to that, at least. That's one of four. There's another satellite over there. Alright, poor life. Poor, poor life decisions. Whee! All right, I'm just going to head towards this, um, this station, since it's right. Yeah, I, f I figured as much. I, okay, those might be satellites, those blue things over there. Nope, let me make it. Whee! Oh, like hell, there's an option to go back up. Alucha, Donfan, Minomoth. Oh, I bet that's what we're looking for. You don't say. That must be one of the buildings the professor was talking about. Oh yeah, we were... What were they called? Uh, ra uh, <coughs> Radish station? Research stations. Oh, that was close. Wow, you have such great memory, Penny. What's a gr what's what's great is my common sense compared to you a lot, apparently. <laughs> Shree! It's a that thing. What the heck is that? That's a Pokemon player. Yeah, I didn't know that. 
I didn't know that species could be found in the great, great, great creator. Come on, let's take it on together. Together. Where are you running off to? I'll just... You got this. I mean, I don't hate the fact that we're working working together, but are there going to be a lot more of these rare Pokemon down here, do you think? You think that was something? Please, you've got no idea how terrifying an area zero really is. Wow, patro patro patronizing much. Okay, this text is too slow. And I thought it would... I, did, I changed the text speed for the um the cutscene text, not this. Easy, you two. Let's head down. Let's head down. Let's just head inside the research station. Is it actually going to be a building or is it going to be like, cutscene? We did it! Or is it actually going to be open? It's a building. Well, these are ancient ruins. Are they? They look far too recent for that. It appears you have reached the first research station without incident. This this facility was constructed 87 years ago as a way station for those surveying Area Zero. So that's why there are beds. There's a bed. Looks like we can use this place to rest if we need it. If you would be so kind as to disable the first lock on the lab using that central panel. Me and only me. You better press it. Lock disable. Three of four are still active. Well done. Please continue your efforts at the remaining research stations. Do we need a rest? Not really. I just saw that portal pad. Skew. I, I, I just want to check. Because I just saw this. Oh. So this could probably take us to other parts of the, um, if we found other research stations, I'm sure that will teleport us, uh, around the map. You know, <laughs> you know how it works. He, it's a giraffe fur thingy. I'm going to, I almost never saw my dad in whole, my whole life. Oh, is it time for a backstory reveal? Penny, <laughs> He was always busy with work. He har hardly ever came home. I cooked myself, cleaned for myself, but Bostiv was the only one I had to talk to. So yeah, I don't really know him at all, even if he is my dad. I tried not to think too much about it. I tried to be proud that he was this famous genius. Famous genius. But the truth is, I'd rather ha just have a dad who was there, even if it wasn't anything great. I haven't f seen him for ages now, unless you count seeing him in the news or whatever. Used to at least get emails sometimes, but even those stopped up to a couple years ago. Then there he appears out of the blue and tells me to come to Area Zero. Area Zero. Area Zero. Sounds family, huh? Oh, uh, but we're not here to judge or anything. And I'm sorry about it earlier. I shouldn't have snapped at you like that. Nana, I was give. I was also giving you a hard time. Sorry, uh, Penny. My name's Penny. You know, you're actually pretty nice for a little pipsqueak. <laughs> Don't call me pipsqueak, you big lunk. <laughs> That's the spirit, you two. <laughs> There's things I want to catch. 
not you. I mean, I don't hate Frost Moth, but this dumb thing. It looks like it's wearing a costume. I'm going to Torch Song because I'm pretty sure at my level I'm going to knock it out with a Snarl. Why the hell is so bad? Baton Pass. Would you get in the Pokeball? I mean, I was going to comment that it hurts, but it's also used a nasty plot before attacking. There you go. The long neck Pokemon. Bing. All right. Before we get it surrounded by Pokemon, I think I'm going to end the episode here before we get too long and find out more story that I can't read. Um, the next base looks like it's there, but I don't, I don't want to miss, I don't want to accidentally miss a station. And I kind of feel like I might have just by jumping down. Okay, that's the one I was just pointing to, or noting. Unless this goes really deep, which it kind of. I don't think it does. So. I mean, it looks like that's a cave. No, it's just a... Is that a cave? It's kind of hard to tell. That right there above my head. I don't know. I... No, that looks like that was something up there. I don't know, but yeah. Well, we can teleport back to the Zero Gate if we get lost, but yeah. Well, we have a plan at least to go to that base station so yeah that's gonna be it for today's episode i will see you guys in the next grind